Hello and welcome back to another Python 3.7 tutorial. My name's Tom with Mastercode Online. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. In to today's tutorial, we're going to talk about the dict build-in function or the dictionary build-in function. Basically, what this function does is it converts a um, an iterable data type like a list, tuple, or a set or keyword argument type layout into a dictionary. So we're going to take a look at this. It's a little different than the other built-in functions like um, uh, list or str for string. It's a little different than that, but we'll take a look at how this all works. So let's first work, uh, take a look at how we create an empty dictionary using this function. So a is equal to dict and we call a and there you go. There's your empty dictionary. Now another way to use this uh, uh, built-in function is to use like a keyword argument type layout and it's going to be uh, let's say b is equal to dict and then we're going to say something like first underscore name is equal to and we'll say tom and then a comma and then we'll say last underscore name is equal to myers and we'll do uh, age is equal to 36 and i'm from the uh, we should do location is equal to and we'll do uh, Philadelphia all right so there you go and when we call B now we got a dictionary here's the key here's the value key value key value and so long so on all right so that's one way to use the, the dict um, built-in function another way to uh, use this is um, passing an iterable data type to it so uh, let's take a look at, let's do uh, A is equal to D-I-C-T and then uh, parentheses and square brackets for a list. And then in here we're going to separate each um, piece of key and value, I should say, separate each key and value as a tuple. So we'll go ahead and do um, first underscore name and comma and then uh, Tom. All right. And then we close that tuple and then we go comma for the next one and we'll do uh, last underscore name and we'll do comma and we'll do Myers. All right, and we'll just end it there so we don't have to keep typing all this out. Hit return, call A. There you go. We got a dictionary, first name, last name. Same thing works for list. We can do uh, A is equal to D-I-C-T. And then a list, then another list, and then we'll do first underscore name, comma, last underscore name, and, oh, no, no, my name, Tom, there we go. And close out that list, then comma, and then the next list would be last name, and then uh, my last name, there you go. Close out that list close out the containing list and then close out your uh, dictionary build-in function hit return call a boom there you go and the same thing works with sets as well if you guys have any questions on how to use this please let me know otherwise we'll see you in the next tutorial where we continue to talk about dictionaries have a lovely day